All right, YouTube, welcome to this week's Have You Ever. Now, I don't remember when I made my last one, if it was this week or not, because I'm dumb and I forget. But we'll just pretend this is a whole new week. Um, this week's question, have you ever, and this is mostly for the guys, because girls, I'm pretty sure you don't stand up when you pee, and if you do, I'm sorry if I offend. Comment below, and I'll make a video, another one, saying how girls, you know, do their thing. But, guys, have you ever gone into a, a restroom? It doesn't matter. I mean, it could be at home. It could have been a public restroom with the stand-up urinals, or if you have a stand-up urinal in your house because you're that cool, I don't know. But have you ever done that? Gone up to the rusty room, unbutton, start to pee, but then at some point, that POTUS fell and hit my back. Thanks for warning me, buttholes. Um... Have you ever gone there and started to pee that at some point you went to squeeze just to get that little bit of pee out and then the back door screaming, let me out, and all of a sudden you have to poop and you feel that peeking turtle coming out like, like it's on fire inside your butthole and he needs to get out ASAP because people are dying. Yeah, it's happened to me a few times. Um, I remember one time I was driving and I was at a stoplight and I passed a little wind, and I got a little bit concerned kiss because I thought that, you know, I was like, whoa, what's going on down there? That was a pretty uh, epic passing of the wind. So then I, I drove, and all of a sudden I realized, I was like, I have to pee really bad. And I was going to a hardware store. Um, some of you may know this place as Harbor Freight. Jufro dude, you'd obviously know that because I always go, well, not always go there, but I've been there a few times in my life, and I like it there. They have... Excuse me. Great tools at reasonable prices. So, yeah, anyways. So I was going there, and I'm pretty sure that that place doesn't have a restroom. Or if they do, I don't know where it would be, because that place just has so many tools. I'm too concerned with all the tools to look for a bathroom. So I'm driving, and I have to pee really bad. And I get to the parking lot where the Harbor Freight is, but then there's a Staples, like, two or three things up. And... I get out of my car and was like, woo, I have to pee really bad. And then I kind of had like those pre-poop jumbles in my back going on. Like, oh my god, let me, let's just do it. Just sit down and <laughs> So I was like, okay, I'm going to go into the bathroom. And this Staples has the weirdest bathrooms. Like you walk in. I said, remember I went back there before. And I asked them where the restroom was because I had to go. And like they said, all the way in the back. And you go in the corner. And then when you walk in, you go to the very back corner. But then when you get to that corner, you turn left, and then you turn left again, and it's like across the thing. And it's really ass backwards to find a restroom, because it's in a corner, then there's another corner, and then you have to walk up steps, climb a mountain, kill some goblins, and then there's a bathroom down yonder. So yeah, I'm making my way back there. I'm trying to, whoosh, whoosh, trying to get there really fast, and then I get there, and then I walk in, stand up to the urinal, do my business, and right, ooh, is that a stink bug? That is a big bug. Anyways. Do my business, and right as I'm finishing, and I'm doing the shakes, two, two shakes to be on, to be, because if you do it more than three times, you're playing with it. Okay, just for the sake of this conversation, it was about three times, just to make sure it was all drained. And I went to zip up my pants, and it hit me, and I was just like, woo, Ugh. and then I quickly ran to the stall and lost signal there. Just the whole, woo, it was a mess. And um, I got concerned because I always had that fear that what if you are about to clean, you know, and the toilet paper runs out. I always thought that could happen to me. And as I'm pulling for that last, I pull and all of a sudden I hear the roll go, because when you know you pull that last little strand off, you pull it and the thing spins like it's out of control. And you're just like, Last piece, but luckily they have those really big ones that if you reach your hand down through like the booby traps and the mouse traps and you pull up, you can get more paper. Luckily they had that and it was stocked properly because then I was just like, no, and I was like, wait, more. And it probably took me about uh, half that roll yet after I used the first half of the roll and it was like, it was like DEF CON level 3 mud butt. It was bad. Like, it looked like someone 
pooped in the toilet and then dropped a stick of dynamite and it just went and just the whole walls what once was white not white anymore it was just all kinds of different colors and oh it was like a play going on in there all kinds of different things were happening over there and it was just bad so um yeah guys has it ever happened to you that you went to go to the bathroom and then as soon as you finish doing the number one number two is knocking at your back door saying hey we got to get this little child out of here because if not we're gonna have problems so yeah comment below tell me what happened if you want and you feel opted to make a video so I could uh, feel more in, in touch with how your scenario went down so I know how your situation happened and um, that'd be great if you just let me know how that stuff happened but yeah that was my story it's kind of hard to talk about that because you know it was kind of a sad day for me because right when I was done I just just the, the walk out of that store I was in there for God knows how long, and then people were just looking at you like, you didn't buy anything, but they don't say it, but they give you that look like, you were in the store for 10 minutes, and you didn't buy one thing. What were you doing? And you're just like, oh, they know, they know that I pooped. And it was just, I had sweat, I was sweating. I'm sweating now even talking about it because it was just bringing back the memories of that particular. So yeah, comment, make a video response, you know, the whole kit and caboodle. Let me know what happened to you. So I'm going to go. Um, nice talking to you. Nice letting you know what happened to me. Um, I'm not going to say that was the only time. It's happened plenty of times. But that was like, on the level of 1 to 10, that was about 35. Because that was, that was up there. So let me know some of your worst poop stories. Well, it started off as a P, and then all of a sudden it turned into whoa. I gotta go right now. Girls, I'm sure that's probably happened to you, but you are lucky because you're already sitting. If you are peeing, and all of a sudden you're just like, whoa, you're already, you're there. All you have to do is go, boop, you're done. You're ready to go. Guys, not so simple. We have to pull our pants back up and then find another toilet of sorts to release ourselves. So you guys are lucky. So I don't even want to hear about it unless you stand, that's different. But um yeah, I'm gonna go now. Thanks for talking to me about this. It was great. Um it was really good for the for our relationship. So I'm gonna go. Um so I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching and goodbye. Oh, and the subscribers are still going up. I'm happy to announce that that every so often I look at my YouTube account and subscribers are going up, going up. So uh let's keep it going, YouTube. Just tell your friends, family, kids. Anyone that's willing to, homeless people, I don't even care. Just tell them and uh, send them to the library where they can make a YouTube account and have them subscribe and then keep in touch with my videos. Try to get my views up a little bit. That's where I'm kind of, yeah, I got a lot of subscribers, but the views are kind of woo. So, like I said, YouTube, tell me what you want to see so I can make the videos that people will watch and enjoy. So I'm going to go. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.